What's going on, champs? What do we have today? We've got a case. We've got a case here. Let's open With it probably up. Probably a guitar in it. Yeah, I think there's yeah. probably, some, hopefully, there's something in here. We're yep. going to look. We're going to look pretty dumb. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What's in the case? Guys, we've got a uh, 2012 Gibson Thunder Horse Explorer in Silverburst. Um, the weight on this guitar is eight pounds, eight ounces. It's got a thin neck on it. Uh, the caliper measurements are the nut width is 1.69 inches. The depth at the first fret is 0.82 inches. The depth at the 12th fret is 0.87 inches. Uh, the pickups are Burst Bucker 1 and 2s. It's got a rich light fingerboard. This thing's rad, man. Super cool. Uh, I loved I loved Death Clock. Yeah. It's back in the late 2000s. Metalocalypse. Era. Yeah. Yeah. It's uh Oh, that's what it yeah, Metalocalypse. Death, Death Clock, Clock Metalocalypse. Yeah. It's all the same. Yeah. yeah. Um I really can you hold that up just a little bit? Yeah, that's probably better. Uh it's an explorer and it's silver bursts. And it's something else that I always talk about how um the only thing that says Thunder Horse or whatever on it is the pit guard. So if you just yeah. wanted a, a a Silver Burst Explorer, there you go. I mean, that's what it is. That's what yeah. it is. Yeah, super cool looking guitar. Silver Burst is my favorite, so Silver I love it. Burst. <laughs> <laughs> Should well, we hear it? Let's hear it. All right. All right, Dylan. And fade. No position yeah it sounds sounds yeah. pretty pretty effing good pretty pretty good, <laughs> pretty, pretty, pretty good. <laughs> let's try it uh this is the middle position you're good yeah dude it, it does that it does it well for being a, mm -hmm. a metal guitar. Mm -hmm. um, let's do the treble pickup for fun. Just okay. the chunk yeah it's it's a sick guitar if you love metal apocalypse even and you just want something cool hanging on your wall dude it's just a mean looking it's guitar brutal, dude in general if you like coffee yeah you know, do you, you like, coffee? like coffee <laughs> yeah dude it's it's dope i love the burst if you like thing. air you should buy this guitar <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> Okay, I gave this one a eight and a half out of 10. It's got some light scratches, some dings, and some wear on the back. Let's check it out. Yeah, so we do see a little bit of tarnish on the hardware. Some scratches on that guard.
Okay, the top looks fairly clean. It's just some light scratches. And the frets are good on this guitar. Let's check them out. There's no wear on them. Some light scratches on the headstock. Looks like we have a little bit of discoloration going on right there. I don't know what that's from. Probably a clip-on tuner or something. <laughs> yep. Okay, and we'll flip this over. Back of the headstock is good. Serial number is 10612-1467. There's your Made in USA. It's a little hard to read because it's black, but that's typical of black uh, Gibsons. Okay, back of the headstock looks good. There's no cracks or anything. Okay. And that is a reflection that you're seeing right there. It's definitely a reflection. They've got a little bit of wear at the back of the neck, but it's not that bad, actually. Okay. Back of the guitar, a little bit of wear going on in the middle there where you would typically see buckle wear, but it's not too bad. All right, there you have it.